Hey guys, so I just got out of the shower and yes, it's like three o'clock in the afternoon. But I've had a bunch of requests again lately to share with you guys like my eyebrow hour routine. So I wanted to actually share it with you guys. Um, I'm using my phone. There's no lighting. In fact, it's like really dark outside. So this is probably not flattering at all. But I figure maybe you'll be able to actually see more and stuff won't be washed out with generous lighting. So because I've been asked a bunch like the actual like maintenance and care. Maybe if I like... Got to give myself the benefit of the doubt here. Um, the actual like maintenance and care and like what I've been doing differently and things like that. So I wanted to share that with you guys and show you because if you go back and watch my videos from a few years ago, you guys know that I have really bad eyebrows and I see it now and that was the thing that I got picked on so much for here on YouTube. My like getting back. Oh, and then poor Drakey. This is, I shouldn't do this in front of him. Look at, you actually look like you have eyebrows here. Here, put your eyebrows down. Put your face down. Just normal. He, um, oh, it's, I'm like, it looks like he does. No, it's just like the shadowing. Looks like you have eyebrows finally. So anyways, I want to share with you guys. So the first thing that I use is this like little tool here. I don't think it needs new battery. It's a little rough starting up. And this is like a little trimmer. And then what I do is I actually like come up here. Hopefully you guys can see this. And I trim anything that is like long. So you know what I mean? So I kind of brush them up a little bit. So it's like super loud in the camera. I brush them up and then any of the long ones like right here that like stand up too high, I just give those a trim. So that way everything's like nice and straight and I'm going to do the same thing underneath. Like, I mean, look at how messy they are. They're horrible. I have the worst eyebrows, <laughs> but at least I have some. Could be worse. Eyebrows. And then over here I do the same. Uh, yeah, there's like a, a bad one there. So anyways, um, so that's how I like keep them here and here and here and here in line. And then it comes with the tweezers. So I like, you know, kind of brush them exactly how I want them. Then I go through and I don't have very many. What's funny is my eyebrows are, they look fuller now and I pluck more. In like five, we'll go get them. And I pluck more now than I ever did before. Because before everybody was like, stop tweezing so much, blah, blah, blah. I wasn't. <laughs> I really wasn't. Now I feel like I tweeze so much, but they look completely different. So it was just kind of getting that shape and then having them grow in, in places that are just kind of like a little different. So um, I'll do this one. So you guys can see, like I've got big natural like splotches in my eyebrows. If they're just thick in some spots and thin in some spots and they just... I don't know. They just grow wonky. So underneath, and I'm still, I'm sure I'm still probably doing this wrong. I just get anything. Oh, that one hurt. That is just like stray. That's it. There's usually like, once that is like the, the grooming part of it. So now like everything's kind of like there that's supposed to be there and tamed and things like that. Now I go back and forth between two things, but I've been using this like jewel up one. It has this tip here and then you flip it over and the makeup's actually in this end and then you follow up with the gel. I like that a lot. But I'm currently back to using the um, Browsings. It's by Benefit. It's expensive. There's an e.l.f. alternative that works just as great. I have it in my car actually. <laughs> so um, I probably won't be buying this again. It just so happens to be what I have and I still have it so I'm using it. So there's two different sides. There's like a, a waxy side. Hey, you see my camera? actually my fancy camera aka my iPhone um, so anyways I put a little of the this one on and then I like actually do it and I'll show you there's like a stray hair gauge I can see you it's gonna get kicked down he's not supposed to be up there okay so I'm gonna do it right here again so I start at the top and I kind of just like work my way up to the the pointy part I guess you can say see my little line and then I just bring it down and then I get a little more and then I do the bottom and I meet it up to the point. So I like come up here and then now that I have like that kind of like planned out, then I just fill it in and I do it as light as I can because I feel crazy when they're super dark. Make a line this way and like go straight over but I like it to kind of like fade into something versus like the super stark lines because I 
I'm still a little weird about actually like having eyebrows and I kind of just like brush it to almost in a way take off some of the makeup but just really light what I do there and then I take the little powder and there's another separate brush for the powder and then I kind of just like really lightly go back over what I've got this one you you can really see what I'm doing on this side so you can see that I have my top line here and then I'm gonna go underneath and do a, like a line on okay, so that is that is what um, that is how I've been doing my eyebrows and I'm gonna finish up the rest of my makeup and kind of show you guys I don't know if it's changed any since the last time I've done my makeup but I'm gonna finish up this um, this video with the rest of my makeup now so I look forward to part two <laughs>